Najua mwingine pale kwenye Twitter ukampata Betty Charlotte Training and number 1 ukajiuliza formally gani kwa sababu most of the time ukimpata mtu akitrend pale kwenye Twitter is either amepatikana kwenye scandal kubwa ama amefanya kitu cha kushangaza. And I'm here to give you the reasons why Betty is trending on Twitter at number 1. Lakini kabla tujendelea kanuma rako ya kwanza kutazama video zetu tafadhali make sure umesubscribe na hiyo kiingia leo kwa hapo mbele make sure umebonyeza pia ili uweze kupata our next trending stories. Kumbuka VMA it was only few days ago ambapo Betty Chalo aliwatangazia mashabiki wake kupitia Instagram yake ya kwamba ameacha kufanya kazi na K24. And rumors have it that she was part of the group of people that was sent home by K24. In short, aliwachishwa kazi. And you, you know most of the time kama umeachishwa kazi, the next move ni kutafuta kazi nyingine ili uweze kupata pesa na and make ends meet. But for Betty Chalo it seems that things are very different on her side. Kwa sababu tangu aachishwe kazi ni kama baraka zimeamua kumfuata zaidi. Na sasa mwana dada huyu amekuwa akionyesha mashabiki wake pale kupitia Instagram yake ya vile amebarikiwa na Mungu ambapo alionyesha mashabiki wake ile saloon ambayo amefungua ambayo inaitwa Flare by Betty. Thank you God, thank you God, thank you God. Thank you God, my father you are amazing. There you go guys. Oh my god, I had to show you guys. I had to show you this. So yeah. Give us give us a few more days. And if that's not enough, mwana dada huyu akanunua gari lingine ambalo ni la German nilinaitwa Porsche Cayenne. I hope nimetamka vizuri Porsche Cayenne. Kama zitamka vizuri niachie the right pronunciation pale kwenye comment section. Na hili gari the reason why watu wanaongelea uh, hivi sana ni kwa sababu ni gari kubwa sana. Na sasa Bet Chalo pale kupitia Instagram yake ile post picha ile gari na kai caption hivi. Better move different if you want different. Another one is home. This time white. Na ile gari lina pesa ngapi? Lina gari mo pesa 66000 750 US dollars and that's approximately to 7.1 million Kenyan shillings. Hey, 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 hey. And that's why many people are talking about it pale kwenye Twitter. Na kwenye Twitter unajua people have different opinions. Wengine wanasema kwamba why would she buy a car wakati hana kazi? Yaani she's buying luxuries instead of investing first. Na wengine wanasema kwamba she can still own it on her own. Hiyo kama maoni yangu mimi naweza sema she can still buy a car on her own without anybody's help. Kumbuka this is not the only car that she owns. Kuna Mercedes flani pale amekuwa kionyesha mashabiki wake kupitia Instagram yake ambapo she owns it. Na sasa pia mimi kwa maoni yangu ni kama I can say uh, she can buy any car she wants as long as she has money. Lakini wewe kwa maoni yako ni gani? Unaweza tuachia maoni yako kwenye comment section utuambie. Na kabla tujamaliza, kama ni mara yako ya kwanza kutazama video zetu, tafadhali make sure umesubscribe hapo. Na hiyo kiingia leo tukatokea hapo mbele, make sure umebonyeza pia ili uweze kupata our next trending stories. Pia kumbuka kutufollow pale kwenye Instagram, Facebook and Twitter at @onnewstv for more trending stories. That is it from us today. Thank you for watching. Let's meet next time. Bye bye.